installing a Lenovo Neptune liquid assisted cooling module. To install the PSU air duct, remove the screw from the chassis. Align the screw holes on the air duct and the chassis and then put the air duct down. Fasten the screw and ensure that the air duct is secured in place. If you have removed the radiator tray, reinstall it on the chassis. If necessary, disconnect the cables from the backplane. Place the tray evenly into the chassis and then move it to the right so that the screw hole on the tray aligns with the hole on the chassis. Fasten the screw. To separate the LACM module from the shipping tray, loosen the four screws on the LACM shipping tray. Use the handle to lift the LACM and separate it from the shipping tray. Attention, if there is any old thermal grease on the processors, gently clean it off with an alcohol cleaning pad. To install the LACM on the system board assembly, align the triangular mark on the cold plate assembly label with the triangular marks on the processor carrier and processor. Install the LACM onto the processor carrier and then press the carrier into place until the clips at all four corners engage. Fasten the eight Torx T20 nuts in the installation sequence shown on the cold plate assembly and the radiator. Fasten the screws and then visually inspect to make sure that there is no gap between the screw shoulder beneath the cold plate assembly and the processor socket. To separate the module handle from the module, unfasten the five screws on the module handle. Lift the handle to separate it from the module. To install the leak detection module on the PSU air duct, install the LACM into the two clips on the PSU air duct and ensure that the module is secured in place. Route the cable through the cable clips to keep it tidy for later cable routing arrangements. Connect the LACM pump cable and leak detection cable to the connectors on the system board assembly. If necessary, connect the cables to the backplane. Route the cable through the cable clips. Install the top cover. Reinstall all the drives and fillers into the drive bays.